Hey guys, and welcome back to another video of our Let's Play on Terraria. So what we're doing is we are going to be making, well not making, we're going to be uh, recoloring my armour. We're going to be um, doing some other stuff, maybe fighting a boss, I'm not really sure yet. Um, in the last video what we did is we basically just spent the entire episode going on a massive quest through the jungle. Again, again, and again. Uh, we went thoroughly through it to try and find a flower called a nature's gift flower, I think it's called, something like that. And um, what eventually happened is we spent the entire episode trying to find it. We couldn't find it anywhere. I then, out of episode, ventured on for another hour before giving up. I then um, went into like a completely new world. I made a new world with a new jungle. And I, eventually, and I spent about an hour and a half in that one. And then I couldn't find it at all. I went through the entire thing, couldn't find a flower. And then I came back to this one and I was like, right, I'm about to give up completely. And eventually what I did is I went to the jungle trying to get, um, see if I had any more luck. I went down and I managed to find one. I don't know why, I don't know if it like spawned randomly or if I just missed it. But it wasn't even like that hidden. Um, it was about, if I show you, if this thing takes a river scroll. It was about there. It was where that little bit of water is. Uh, there, right in the middle of the screen. And it was just sitting there. I'm like, the, like it's just a bit, bit of grass. And I was like, why did I miss that? So either I went straight past it or it spawned in. And I don't know if they do spawn in or if they're spawned in with the world. So yeah, I don't know how that works. But that's mainly what one of the things we're going to be doing today. Other than that, we're going to be trying to sort these boots out. Because these boots look weird in my armour so far. So what the idea is, is that we're going to recolour them. Now I got this violet stuff. I don't know if this is the right colour. Because a comment on my last video told me that uh, you had to get purple dye from things in the ocean. They did say what it was, but I can't remember. Um, so I'm going to see what this is like. Because I know the dyes can look different in all their different ways, obviously. So I'm going to see how good this looks. And if it looks bad, then I'll do the other thing. So I think that looks a bit too bright. That looks more, more magenta kind of colour. Oh, that's just that thing. I need to dye this one. Yeah, yeah, that's more pinky. So I need to actually find purple. So that's our test for today. I'm not going that way because I've been that way enough times. I'm going to go this way. So don't go to the... I haven't even been to like this full thing yet. What I do need to do as well is I need to... Um, what's it cool? I need to get some breathing gear. It'll be interesting. But I don't know if I actually will bother, because I know it's a really rare chance to actually get breathing gear, like, by finding it. Whereas, in hard mode, there's a thing you can make with a load of, like, um, stuff from the ocean, like, if you get some souls, some fins and stuff like that, you can make a thing called, uh, what's it called, Neptune Shell. Um, and what that does is it turns you into, like, a fish thing, like a fish freak. And then you can swim around infinitely, have infinite breath and all stuff. And I find that much more useful than using, like, breathing gear. So I might be doing that. Well, I will be doing that. But I don't know about the breathing gear. It depends if we accidentally come across it. Because the way to get it is you have to get it from sharks. And by that, it's dangerous in itself. So I don't know if I can bother to do that. But yeah, we should have fun doing it, at least. Now, I, I completely forgot what they said the the thing drops. Like, uh, what drops the purple stuff. I think it's purple mucus, maybe? Because I thought it was squid, but I'm pretty sure squid drop, drop black ink. Um... I think I'm right in saying that. And then, other than that, I think this is how you, like, you have to get it from something else. But I think it was like a sea snail, maybe. I've got vague memories of coming back. But I'm just going to go down here. I know you can also find chests down here, but I don't know if I'll, can I hold my breath long enough to do that. Hello there. Oh, these things have glow sticks. I forgot how you get them. There's coral. We need to get coral for that thing later on. Oh, there's a chest. Take everything in there, and I'm actually going to take the chest. Because I don't want to die, even though that's very much going to happen. I'm going to end up dying here, aren't I? Yep. I'm just going to slowly start dying. This was a bad idea. Can I get out? No. Well, we're doing alright. We'll get out of it. Hello, Vulture. Dying one hit. There we go. Now, uh, that's quite a lot of that sword. There's nothing down here. We just have to wait for the snail to come along. I can't remember what the snail looks like. We've got a water chest, though. That's cool. I don't know if we have one of them or not. But also, we can use them for later. Healing potions might use them. And Trident, 11 damage, that's not going to do much. Oh, have you just despawned? How dare you. Do I have to sit in the ocean for it? Well, while that's happening then, I'm going to go down here. And I'm going to gather some of this stuff up. Lime kelp, that makes green dye. Um, is that seashell? Starfish. What I do you need to get is coral down here. Oh, there's a crab. Hello, crabby. If I get coral, that'll help me. I also need to get back up quickly. Come on, there we go. This is the danger of going down here. It's very temperamental. I can get out. Come on, I can do this. Maybe not. 
Right, that's the last time I do that, because I'm going to end up dying otherwise. If I stay in the water, they're going to spawn in. There's something very slow making its way here. I'm going to stand out of the water there. There we go. T-shirt, can we place? Okay, that's all I can do. I don't want these things. I've got these. I've got my only ones I need. Uh, lime kelp, can we submit lime dye? Is the sea snail coming? There's three things coming. I don't know what they are. Are they all crabs? One crab. Another crab. Another crab. How rare is sea, sta uh, sea snails? Because if they're very rare, I don't know why I'm bothering to do this. So I'm not going to spend like... I'm not going to spend ages down here if it's not going to do anything. Okay, that's a jellyfish. That, the other one's despawned. Right, that's enough of that. I'm not going to find that for the minute. That could, this can wait. That can wait. My idea eventually is to get frost armor, but I can't do that yet because I'm not in hard mode. So yeah, that's fine. Right, let's uh, quickly do that. So we're not going to be doing that at all today, unfortunately. That was kind of a fail. Anyway, um, I'm going to put some of this stuff away. I don't need- I always go for that chest. I need to move them two chests around. I'm used to that end one being full of that, um, like the dyes and things. Uh, coral, that can go up there. Sand can go in the middle. Um, kelp. Uh, and then these just go in here. Like so. Oh yeah, I also got- my mushroom farm's coming along well as well. Which is also what I want to show you in a minute. Uh, I don't want that at all. Right, um, yeah, my mushroom farm. Which is actually um, coming along quite well. I think it's completely done. So I'm gonna go harvest it. So this is how you make potions with, which I'm gonna need to, which I'm gonna need to do in a minute. Let's see, we've got a whole biome here now. For it. And what the idea is, is that eventually we're gonna get um, a truffle guy to spawn in. Now because this hap this hasn't happened yet, and last time when I did this it was really quick. I'm assuming that I do need to uh, build a little house for him, like an actual mushroom house. So I'm going to do that, but I need to get loads of mushrooms for that. I might do that in this video if we have enough mushrooms. So I'm going to collect them and just see where we go with it. We need them for potions and stuff. Now, what was the thing I needed to make this nature's gift into exactly what I need? Mr. Guide, you're down here. Thank you. I need to talk to you. Uh, this thing. Okay. I need a normal mana potion. Do I have one of them? Probably not. Let's make one. Uh, no, I don't. Mana potions are made by... How do we make mana potions? I think we need to buy two of them from this guy. Come back here. Come back. There we go. We need to buy two of them from you. And then we combine them with the potion thing. Uh, yep, there we go. And then we go to the Tinker's workbench, which is over here. And what are these things? Build a potion. Increases placement speed. Nah. Uh, there we go. Mana flower. Automatically uses mana potions when needed. They better not have changed this, because last time I used this, it was very useful. Right, so what am I going to replace this? Oh, what? I've got another mana flower. A uh, nature's gift. If I had that in the last video, and I didn't see that, I'm going to be very annoyed. Because I could have probably picked that up, and it's really going straight in my inventory, wouldn't it? Please don't tell me that was in the last video. I'm going to check that now, and I'm probably going to kick myself. Alright, enough of that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to... How much money do I have? Um, one gold coin. I'm going to buy as many of these mana potions as I can. I'm going to need them. 25. Okay. Is that all of them? Oh no, I can buy more than that. Wait, are they stacking 25s? Yeah, they do. They're very cheap, actually. Okay. That's that. Now I'm going to make loads of these as many as I can into the bigger ones. Don't know what we're going to run out of first. Okay, we've run out of those things. That's fine. Um, so we've got 37 of them. So what the idea is, is this. Watch. So if we use this flower of fire, which I'm yet to use, actually. Got like this. Watch my magic. Watch the magic. Eventually want to use them all up. Oh, does it actually... No, it does do that. Oh. That's not fair. They, they used to have that, so it was infinite, so you could literally just keep firing it. Oh, that is not fair. Does that mean I actually can't do that now? Let me just see what it does if I do this. Okay. Will it just not do it again? That's taking way too long. Okay, this uses more. Oh, no, it does. Okay, there you go. So it gives me the timer, but it doesn't make a difference. See? So I've just wasted it twice, but that's fine. 
Right, um, we don't need these things anymore. I need to make these, uh, some more of these better. That's not the main, that's not the next idea is. Anyway, um, I'm gonna make some mushroom blocks so I can try and actually get, give the guy a home. Um, how do I make this? Can I make a mushroom candelabra? That'll be interesting. I know you can make like a mushroom workbench and stuff. Mushroom candles. That looks quite nice actually. Putting them all over the floor look quite nice. Um, how do we make this stuff again? I've forgotten how we do this. What's that? A weapon rack. Ooh. I don't know you can make them. What's that? Mushroom bench? Where's the workbenches? I know you can make workbenches out of them. Uh, workbench. Where's the actual workbench themselves? There we go. Ten of them, really. Yeah, we're not going to have anywhere near enough mushrooms, I don't think. Like, the mushrooms that I have, uh, half from, uh, like, some of them are from this. Oh, it's grown. And, um, some other ones from, like, when I went mining, and I've just found some biomes. Oh, that's wrong. I'm using it. I'm using it as if I've got the, the other pickaxe thing. My mushrooms, and... There we go. Get that. They give you quite a lot of them things. Come on. More glow mushrooms. There we go. So we can make a nice little house. Let's make it uh, here, because why not? And I'm going to put it along here. La 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 la. Will that be big enough for him? I don't know what the requirements are. I haven't played this game in ages. Like, I haven't done like their furnishing things in ages on this. That'll be enough. There we go. We can put this little workbench down. This will actually help me if I'm out here and I need to do building. Um, put that there. Oh, we need to make mushroom walls, don't we? I remember that. Yeah, we're also getting these guys spawning now as well. Go away. These guys are really tough to kill, actually. Surprising. Very surprising, that is. Alright, we need to make a mushroom background. With as many of these as we can. So, how do we make mushroom backgrounds? So, these things? Cool. I don't know how many we can actually make, because we don't have much. Die! Slimes. There we go. I'm gonna put these along here. Probably not gonna have enough, but that's fine. That was too much. Cool. Right. Go away, slimes. That's the problem with this place. We probably we could get overrun with a load of um, slimes. Mushroom wall is mine. There we go. Make a few more of those. There we go. I don't want to make too many because I want to make sure I have enough to do everything else. Okay, one more. Put that down there. All right. Do you have enough to make a door? Um, a door is made. Yes, I do. Just enough. Now we need a light source, which is like that. And that. That's wrong. How many, how many mushrooms do I have now? I have one. I don't have enough to do anything. So what I need to do is I need to make a... Get out of the I need to make a... Um, what's it called? I need to make a uh, chair now, don't I? I don't know how much uh, chairs cost. Where are the chairs? Chairs are here. Need four. Might be able to do that. Let's have a look. La 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 la. One. Oh, I've got one of these things spawning. Oh dear. That's not very good, is it? There we go, we've got enough. That should be enough now. Hopefully when we put this in, it'd be deemed a possible house. Kill you. Chair. Cool. I love how we're just scraping by with this stuff. Right, is this valid housing? Um, how do you do it? I check housing. This housing is suitable. Good. So that means the guys should be able to come. If I remember correctly, if they haven't changed anything, I probably know they will. So I mean, we're in the biome. Is it right for them? My only worry is if, because I'm here, is that account is not being in the biome. But it should be. If not, I can just add some more stuff over there, like more mushroom stuff. Which I might end up doing, because I just like the, bu the biome anyway. So let's go. I'm going to make a little bit more of that, because I feel like that's probably what's going to help it. I'm going to put the dirt and stuff first in this one. Cool. Up we go. See, we are making progress. Making slow progress, but it's still progress nonetheless. Very slowly getting there. Okay, we've got another one of these things. Let's go. Hello there. How you doing? Die. Ow. We could grow the trees here if we wanted to. I keep using that as a thing, but it's not. Yeah. If we grow normal acorns here, does it grow trees? Like the mushroom trees? 
I guess it will do that. That would be an interesting thing to find out. Hello. Go away. Zombie Eskimo. I'm trying to build a house for my mushroom friend. Not you, mushroom friends. You're not You're not friends. You're evils. You're meanies. You're meanies. Go away. Die, will you? Here we go. Go. We can do this. Go. Nice mushroom place for all of our friends. Which is only one of them because there's only one mushroom guy here. There you go. That works out, doesn't it? This should help uh, soon at one point be a decent sized biome. It's just good to have a big biome of this anyway. Just because like, you get those mushrooms for it. And the mushrooms are the main thing I want from it. He's got stuff, he's got mushrooms growing in his house. Do you want that or not? I think that might be a bit wrong. <laughs> I need to fix that. I don't know, like, because the housing is suitable, so I assume it's fine. If I don't get him by the end of the video, then I'm assuming I've done something wrong, and I'll have to check it. But I don't know what I've done wrong if I have done something wrong. So, that's that done. So, we've done that guy. I don't know what this thing is for. I think it's for, like, a potion swing. Anyway, we're going to make potions now, because I need to actually learn how to do it. So, this thing. Let's see what ones we need. Build a potions? No. Create a potion? What's that? to get a crate. I don't even know what that is. Uh, gravitation potion, we don't need them. Arch, we don't need them. Thorns, don't need them. Night Owl, don't need that. A shine potion would be pretty useful, actually. Because what I also need to do to get loads of this stuff is to make a um, like place to farm this all. So I've got some seeds for some of it, so I need to do that. That's Blunk potion. I don't know if I need to make them immediately. I'll find out. All these. Magic, mana, old water, gills potion. That would have been useful a little while ago. Swiftness. Uh, regeneration. Obsidian skin. I want to make a few of these, but I need to get some more water leaf. Um, the main thing I need to do is I need to learn how to make this stuff. Because I know with Fire Blossom, like, for the stuff, which is, um, these things, if I can find them. Oh, they're not there. No, not there. These things. Um, you need to get Fire Blossom seeds, which are very rare, I think. They take ages to get, so I'm worried about doing that. I don't know what else I can do for this video because we're kind of running out of time. Uh, but I don't know what we can fit in at the end. The idea was to try and fight a boss, but I don't think I'm able to do that because I need some more stuff before I do that now that I just realised it. Right, this potion can go in here because I don't need it for a minute. And this, I don't know, I don't know how I got that. If, I'm going to check that last video, and if I have this nature's gift in my inventory, I'm going to be very annoyed. I will be very annoyed. Um, acorns can go in. Wait, let me just see. Can I, if you plant acorns, do they grow into the mushroom things? Get rid of that, I don't want it. Right. I don't need to worry about them, um, shiver thorn things, because they're easy to get. I can win the snow vine. Oh, I can't grow them here. Okay. That does make sense, because I guess it's just the mushroom growing on its own, doesn't it? Look, like this one. Just need to wait for this to grow. Oh, it just grew as I said it. So. It's eventually coming, around. We'll do fine. It'll do fine. Now... Like I said, the idea was to get the armor recolored, but that's not gonna happen. I don't know how to get the frost things, like the frost armor. I think you can only get it in. Um, that's wrong. I think you can only get it in. Uh, what's it called? Hard mode. Because I don't think it's actually possible to get it now. But oh well. Not too much of a problem. So. I guess we do what I want. I don't know. I probably am gonna end it here, because I don't really know what else to do. I mean, other than this, I'm just wasting time, to be honest. Because. We got this guy. I may just want to see if he joins, uh, but I don't know if he will. Nothing's come up on screen unless it has not been blind. But I doubt it. Um, other than that, if it doesn't turn up, then I'm gonna have to like check some of the stuff. Like I might have to make the floor a real block rather than this stuff. I'll check my other house that I've got in my other world. So now I've got a truffle in that one, and I want to do that. So yeah, this video has been kind of productive. We did what we wanted to do, and we got our infinite magic thing, which is the main important thing. Now. Next video, what we're going to do is we are probably going to speak to the truffle guy. Maybe buy stuff off him, I'm not sure. Because I can't remember what he sells, actually. But then we probably will end up killing that boss that I was saying about. And also probably making a farm for all, like, the flowers and stuff. I might dedicate just, like, a couple of videos to that. Because I do need to, it does need to be done. And I think it might be interesting. But yeah, that's for now. And thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you later. Goodbye.